I'm here in the home of Douglas Slocum, who shot many, many films over the years, from Raiders of the Lost Ark, Close Encounters, um, The Man in the White Suit. We're here talking about the Titfield Thunderbolt, a film that he made with Charles Crichton for Ealing Studios in 1953. When Charles Crichton and I went down to do a connoissance, I sort of grabbed my uh, my home movie camera, a 16 mil Bell and Howell, I remember, and so, so just took some shots while I was at it, just to remind us of the of what the, the place would look like, an old-fashioned little railway uh, line with a, a, a single a single track railway and a, one of the old steam engines, a rather small thing. In some ways, the last reminders of uh, the type of railway system and also life in the countryside that existed in that period, as I say, in the 1950s. The, the, the thing that we were searching for was not only a suitable line that would be available to us, but also a railway station that we could use. And it, we, we, we did, in fact, find uh, a disused railway station, which eventually we had to sort of uh, you know, do things to. Uh, the little movie I took was a sort of fun movie in a way, because I remember Charles Crichton, the director, he always liked to g gag a bit. And on one occasion, he was suddenly conscious of the fact that I was shooting him. And I remember starts to walk backwards. So so, so that sort of thing. But but a anyway, the, 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 the movie just, just gives an idea of some of the things that happened. And there were one or two shots, uh, I remember, uh, yes, uh, showing us at work uh, with, with the with the, the camera, the Technicolor camera, and and the the the, 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 the yes uh, the, the the old Titfall Thunderbolt. <laughs> 